I once heard you say that Hoops Nation probably won't be forever. Yeah. And you're focused on your personal brand. Uh-huh. Can you elaborate on that a little bit as to why? Yeah, for sure. I think no platform uh, will be around forever. Like a great example of that is Hoops Nation on Facebook. Like it was popping on Facebook. I had videos that got 50 million views on Facebook. Like that's a crazy, crazy number. Um, but now if I posted a video, it would barely get any interaction. But the reverse is the case on Instagram. Instagram right now is what it used to be like on Facebook. Um, but if you can build a personal brand that's bigger than any of these platforms and you start hosting things uh, on air for companies, let's say ESPN in a couple of years or whatever it may be, or the NBA right now, um, then it gets a little bit bigger when, when people will know who you are on any platform, more so than, than following on a specific platform for content that they can get from a bunch of other sources. Um, so that's what I think the benefit of building a big personal brand is. Uh, and also, I want to be able to be me more than have to 100% follow the niche of basketball, um, which is still like 70, 80% of me, but there's like another 20% that I'm experimenting in, um, which are, you know, other passions and, you know, the business side behind the basketball and some of the stuff that isn't just the on court analysis. Uh, and you know response to people and stuff like that mm-hmm. yeah and so how are you going to plan to grow your personal brand outside of hoops nation because i feel like the two are very intertwined very is it going to be doing work with like the nba mm-hmm. and getting your face and your name out there other ways outside of hoops nation for sure yeah a lot of its relationships with players and, and people like that in the basketball world that's all it is so mm-hmm. you know it's working with the nba it's you know hopping on a bunch of podcasts like it's it's you know, just being out there, going to events, you know, creating personal brand content that isn't posted on Hoops Nation anywhere. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, you know, everything of that nature and creating from that regard um, is super important. Uh, and then beyond that, um, just divulging further into YouTube content creation and creation separate from basketball. And then, uh, you know, starting to collaborate with people outside of basketball. And then you're integrating or, you know, opening yourself up to people that have literally never heard of you or literally never seen who you are and literally don't know anything about the basketball side of you, which is the other avenue.